G'day guys and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing off something I'm really excited about. It's the Kinevia software and what this is, is I've been able to use my web cameras to actually give me an audio triggered video on each swing. So when I have the software open and this set up, I'll hit a shot and the audio of the actual shot will be captured by the mic on my webcam and then the recording will start in Kinevia and it will actually record a three second clip of my swing. Now what's cool about this is I was gonna invest quite a lot of money into buying swing optics cameras for my Unicore system, for the view system. And to be honest, I, I'm, I probably will end up doing something like that. But this at the moment is actually a free option for me personally. So I've downloaded the Kinevia software. Um, I have two web cameras. I've got two 4K Logitech Brio webcams. And that's what I'm essentially using for this. So I have had the Live View Pro and I've been using this quite a lot now that I'm getting back into swing work. I'm trying to record my swing, replay my swing. The key with doing swing changes is having feedback. The ability to um, differentiate between what you feel and what is actually real is huge. And by having something where you can use your webcams or, or any software like the Live View Pro camera where you can hit a shot and instantly see your swing, that is huge. Now, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bring it up today. I'll leave a link in the description to Kinevia, the actual website. I'll also leave a link in there of how to actually set this up because it's quite easy. I'm not gonna do a video on how to set this up because if you follow that actual list, it is super simple and I'm sure you'll be able to do it. But what I'm gonna to do today is I'm gonna open Kinevia. I have downloaded it. I'm using my other camera today because when I try and use OBS with the Kinevia software open, it, it doesn't like it because it's trying to use the web cameras in OBS and also Kinevia. So for the purpose of today, I'm just gonna use my uh, main camera and you'll be able to see exactly what I'm talking about on my projector behind me. Setting this up is really simple. Don't, uh, don't worry, if you have questions, join the Facebook group, but um, setting this up is really simple. Also, this has been around for years. It's not something that's new. This has been around for, I'm talking like, you know, 10 or not 10, but like, you know, six to seven years, this has been available. So um, just be aware of that. It's not something new, it's something new to me, but it's not something new to the industry and, and people who, who are in the know. Okay, so I'm gonna open up the software and you will see this open up behind me. The key to getting this up and running is you've got to have a capture window and then you've also got to have a replay window up. So you actually need to open this software twice. It explains everything in the link, in that checklist. Just follow it, it's really easy and simple. But what I'll, I'll do is now, because I've set this up once, I'll, I'll quickly set, get it set up again and then I'll hit some shots and show you exactly what I'm talking about. Okay, so I have got it set up behind me. I've got the recording screen and also the replay screen set up. Now I can simply hit a shot and what you'll see, when I do this, I've kind of got my own little uh, free Unicore View uh, Swing Optics setup ready to go. It's gonna be using the audio of when I actually hit the shot. Okay, so a little pitch shot with a 60 degree. It's captured that audio. And as you can see on my screen now, I have my replay of that pitch shot that I just hit. Now that will loop as well. So I'll be able to watch it as, as many times as I want. And if I'm making swing changes, this is huge because now I'm getting instant feedback. Did I take that away inside? Did I take that away outside? Um, did I drop it? Did I come over the top? I can see all of that. So I'll hit another shot now. Again, it's gonna capture that audio and the swing pops up straight away and I can see the adjustments I've made or you know if I need to change anything. Okay, with that, let's open up the, the Kinevia software and I'm just gonna show you what you can actually do because it's quite cool in this software. So in this software, you do have the ability to um, go slow motion, you can go fast forward. What I'll do now is I'll open OBS up and I'll show you exactly what you can do um, with this uh, software. Okay, so I've got my display capture up now and what I'm gonna show you now are the tools that you can actually access in the Kinevia software. So you do have the ability to make this uh, slow motion so you can slow down your swing even more you can pause it, and depending on what camera you have, if you've got a really high speed, um, good camera, you can get a lot more frames. 
my camera, like I said, I'm just using a webcam. At the moment, it's set on 60 frames per second. If you know how to optimize this, if you're all over this software, please reach out to me and let me know because I'm still very much in the beginnings of learning this software. So you can go frame by frame. Yes, it's not gonna be as good as you know your Swing Optics cameras, but you can buy other cameras specifically to use for this software that are gonna give you that real crisp, clear image. Um, but you can, you've got all your frames there. Now, the other thing you can do, we'll go back to the start of my swing. The other thing you can do is you can actually draw lines, you can draw circles, uh, you can draw whatever you want. At the moment, the line's orange, you can change the color of the line. So if we wanted, uh, say for instance, a, uh, a red line or something like that, or a white line, you can do that. Simply go down to line and we can select a different color. If we wanted, say for instance, a yellow line, make it stand out a bit more, we can go apply, and then we can redraw that line and it will be yellow. So you can have yellow lines, blue lines, red lines, whatever you want. Um, and then we can, we can simply play the swing and we can just see, hey, we've got a line now there for our club. You can see I take it a bit upright and then on the way down, we drop it back down pretty much perfectly onto that line and through impact there. And the shaft at impact is pretty much matching exactly that line at address. So that's really cool to see. Um, like I said, the frames on this aren't going to be as good as your Swing Optics cameras or dedicated specific cameras um, for this software. I know Carl's Place sells cameras that you can use specifically for this software. But I mean, for what you get, this thing, you've got to remember, I downloaded this software for free on the internet. Check the link in the description to find it yourself. I'm just using my web camera, which I already had. So this setup right now to analyze my swing is completely free. Just think about that for a second. Pretty amazing. You can hook up to have dual cameras. So when I do this, um, when I'm actually practicing my swing now, I actually have my front on and down the line cameras side by side. The reason I've just got the single uh, view there today is just for the purpose of this video. I need this uh, tripod for the camera to film me. You cannot have OBS open while you have this software open if you're using the same cameras. So that's the reason I didn't have OBS open at the start because they don't like to each other and it causes, they don't talk to each other. The cameras can only be used for one specific software and so they just, it just doesn't play nice. But yeah, that is Kinevere and that's something that I'm gonna be using to get my swing back to where I know it can be and where it should be. The cool thing about this is you can draw lines, you can uh, you know really analyze your swing if you know what you're doing. You can really lock down those feels and reels. And what I mean by that is you feel like you're doing something in your swing. In reality, you're not. And this software, and by using cameras like this, getting instant feedback, you're really gonna be able to tell when you've done something and then check it straight away. So I'm gonna be using this a lot. Hope you guys enjoyed that. If you did let me know any comments or questions, let me know down below and I will catch you guys in the next one. Cheers.